This is the trunk muscle, superficial and deep, on the ventral side of the rabbit. This is going to be your rectus abdominis. Your linea alba is going to be the imaginary line that goes down the middle of the rabbit. Um, you actually can't put a pin in it to identify it like that. You're just going to have to know that it's the imaginary line. Um, again, that's called the linea alba. So if I asked you it on the practical, it would be a extra credit question, what is the imaginary line down the rabbit? Again, linea alba. We go into the obliques. The skin flap right here is going to be your external oblique. This portion inside is going to be your internal oblique. So external oblique, internal oblique. Move the rabbit onto its chest. This flap of skin here is going to be your pectoralis superficials. Superficial implying that it's on the outside. We flip it open. This section right here is going to be your pectoralis profundus. So pectoralis superficialis. And this is the inside portion is your pectoralis profundus. If we go into the arm muscles, you've got your biceps brachii and your triceps brachii. Going into the shoulder muscles, which are going to be deep tissue muscles on the back side, on the dorsal side of the rabbit, we have the supraspinatus and the infraspinatus. Again, supraspinatus and the infraspinatus, superior versus inferior. Your teres major and your serratus centralis are more easily viewed on this side of the rabbit. If you look under the arm portion, right through here, this is going to be the fan-like shape. That's your serratus ventralis. Underneath of that, this muscle that's down here, that's going to be your teres major. So serratus ventralis, teres major. All right. And then flipping him back over onto the dorsal side, we're going to do the trunk muscles that are superficial and deep. So over here, you've got your latissimus dorsi. This flap of skin right there is going to be your lumbodorsal fascia. Underneath, if you flip it up, this layer right here is going to be your multifidus. The triangle that's up here, above the supraspinatus and infraspinatus, this area here, is your trapezius cervical, cervical implying it's by the neck. The inverse triangle on the other side is going to be your trapezius thoracic, thoracic implying that it's over the chest. And then also down through here, this side portion of your rabbit here is your longissimus dorsi.